systems of linear equations po tayo. Dito sa mga problems na to, una nating alamin if anong kind of graph meron tayo or yung equation. Dito meron tayong equation of the line tapos parabola opening upward kasi naka x squared. So isa lang yung naka squared. Dito since pareha sila y. So y is equal to y. 2x squared is equal to 2x plus 4. Lipat sa kabila lahat. So 2x squared minus 2x minus 4 is equal to 0. Ito, pwede natin i-divide 2. Simplify lang natin into lowest form niya. So, x squared minus x minus 2 is equal to 0. So, x plus 2, tsaka x, baliktad, x minus 2, tsaka x plus 1. Yung factor niya. So, x is equal to positive 2. Ito naman, x is equal to negative 1. Inequate lang sa 0. So, when x is equal to 2, pwede natin siyang i- substitute kahit saan dyan na equation. So, gusto ko sa unang equation, yung linear. So, 2 times 2 plus 4 y is equal to 8. So, when x is negative 1 naman, so y is equal to 2 times negative 1 plus 4 y is equal to positive 2. Okay? So, therefore, so intersection points is at 2, 8 and negative 1, positive 2. Ito yung intersection point nila. So, kapag ginraft natin siya, so wala naman sa tanong, pero i-graft natin siya. Yung intersection point ay 2, tsaka positive 8. So, nandito banda. Sabihin natin ganyan. Ito yung 2, 8. Negative 1, positive 2 naman yung y. So, nandito siya. Ayan. Ito yung line. Since dumaan siya parehas dyan. Parabola naman is, ang vertex niya ay 0, 0 eh. Ibig sabihin pa ganun. Pa ganun yung parabola natin. Ayan. Tumama parehas. So ito yung intersection nila. 2, 8. Tapos negative 1, positive 2. Ganun lang yung number 1. Next question natin. Itong unang equation ay circle. So, the same coefficient yung x squared tsaka y squared tapos plus. So, pangalawa naman is a hyperbola. So, different sign sila. Ang ellipse is parehas siya sa circle na may x squared and y squared tapos plus. Pero, iba yung coefficient nila. Hindi sila parehas ng coefficient. So, ito is circle and hyperbola. Pwedeng apat na points ang tumama. Pwedeng dalawa. Pwede rin isa. So, depende. Isold natin siya. Dito sa problem na ito, maganda siyang elimination kasi since parest ng coefficients lahat ng variable natin. So, gusto kong eliminate muna yung x squared. Copy natin yung lahat ng equations. Minus yung gagawin kong operation para ma-eliminate yung x squared. Magiging 2y squared na to is equal to 8 over 2 over 2. y squared ay 4. Square root mo siya. Square root din dito. So y is equal to plus minus 2. Plus minus, huwag kalimutan kasi negative 2 squared ay positive 4 din. So dalawa yung roots niya dapat dyan. So, when y is equal to positive 2, ano naman ang x? So, when y is positive 2, so, gusto ko dito sa equation 1. So, x squared plus 2 squared is equal to 12. x squared, to ay 12 minus 4. So, 8 square root, square root. So, x is plus minus So, square root of 8 is 2. Square root of 2. Ayan. Ibig sabihin, ang coordinate ng ito is positive 2 square root of 2. Positive 2. Tapos, meron tayo negative 2 square root of 2. Positive 2. So, dalawang intersection points na kagad na kukuha natin dito. Ayan. Positive 2. Tapos, plus minus kasi. So, dalawa. 
intersect sila dyan. So, when y is equal to negative 2 naman, dahil dito, so, gamitin natin yung pangalawang equation, so, x squared minus, kahit saan naman dyan, pwede. So, negative 2 squared is equal to 4. Yan siya. So, x minus 4 x squared. Yan. So, x squared is positive 8 na. So, x is 2 square root of 2 pa rin. Plus, minus. Ibig sabihin, ang intersection points niya ay 2 square root of 2, negative 2 yung y. Tapos, negative 2 square root of 2, negative 2 yung y. So, ito yung sagot natin. Apat yung intersection points nila. Kapag ginraft natin siya, circle, center is 0, 0. Tapos, square root of 12 yung ano, radius. So, sabihin natin, estimate natin pag anon. Ang hyperbola natin is horizontal transverse axis kasi x squared ang nauna. Pag anon siya. So, estimate lang din ulit pag anon. Ganyan yung graph natin. Ang intersection points nila ito. Apat. Center ng hyperbola natin ay pareha sa center ng circle natin. Zero, zero. Ibig sabihin, ito yung 2 square root of 2, positive 2. Ito naman yung 2 square root of 2, negative 2. Depende sa quadrant na signs. Ito naman is yung negative 2, square root of 2, positive 2. Ito naman yung negative 2, square root of 2, negative 2. Hmm. Next problem natin dito, pwede natin tignan muna if meron tayong ma-eliminate na naka-quantity or yung naka-parenthesis. Dito, wala silang the same na, na, na parenthesis na value. Walang magkaparehas. So, no choice tayo dito. expand natin lahat. Dito, Magiging x squared minus 2x plus 1. Technique dyan. x squared tapos x times negative 1. So, negative x times 2. Kaya naging negative 2x. Tapos, plus y squared minus... So, y times negative 3. Negative 3y times 2. Negative 6y na yan. Negative 3 squared plus 9. Is equal to 10. Tapos, x squared... Ito, simplify natin, plus y squared minus 2x minus 6y. So, ito, positive 10 minus 10, 0 na siya. Ito yung equation 1 natin. Ang pangalawa naman, x squared plus y squared minus 2y plus 1 is equal to 5. x squared plus y squared minus 2y, so minus 4 is equal to 0. Ito yung equation 2. Pwede natin ma-eliminate itong dalawang to, equation 1 and equation 2. Pag minusin natin sila, copy natin, minus yung operation para mag-cancel tong x squared, y squared. So, negative 2x, negative 6y, minus minus, so minus 4y pala yan. Tapos, plus 4 is equal to 0. Plus 4 na siya kasi dito. Minus, minus 4. So, ito simplify natin. Divide natin ng negative 2. So, magiging positive x na siya. Plus 2y minus 2. It's equal to 0. Or, lipat natin lahat yung 2y sa right side. So, magiging negative 2y plus 2. Bin natin, ito yung equation 3. So, Ito, substitute natin doon. Magiging minus 2y plus 2 squared yan. Plus y squared minus 2 times yung x minus 2y plus 2 minus 6y. So, equal to 0. Yan, puro y na lang matitira dyan. Ito, expand natin to. Negative 2 squared is positive 4. y squared Tapos, minus 2y times 2, minus 4y times 2, so minus 8y yan, plus 4, plus y squared, plus na siya, 4y, 
minus 4 minus 6y is equal to 0. Ayan. Simplify mo lang siya. 4y squared plus y squared, 5y squared, minus 8y plus 4y, negative 4y, minus 6y, minus 10y, tapos 4 minus 4 is 0. Naging ganyan siya. Factor out natin, since 5 common siya, labas yung 5y, magiging y minus 2 is equal to 0. To is equate sa 0 to, kaya y is equal to 0, 5y is equal to 0, yan eh. Ito naman equate sa 0 din, y is positive 2. Tapos, meron tayong equation 3, to. When y is equal to 0, x is, so negative 2 times 0 plus 2, x is positive 2. Yan. So when y is positive 2 naman, x is negative 2 times positive 2 plus 2, x is negative 2. Therefore, ang intersection point nila ay intersection points ang isang x ay positive 2, 0 ang y and x is negative 2, tapos positive 2. Ito yung intersection points. So, dalawang circle yan. Isa ay center niya ay 1 and 3. Isa naman 0 and 1. So, ito yung intersection point nila. Next problem natin. So, circle tong isang equation. Yung isa naman is ellipse. Dito, pwedeng elimination na kaagad ang gamitin nating method. Kasi, madali lang siya. So, itong equation 2 na ellipse, pwede natin i-multiply siya ng 18. Kasi gusto kong eliminate yung x squared. Multiply ko siya ng 18, magiging x squared na siya. Plus 18y squared over 32 is equal to 18. Minultiply ko sa 18. Tapos, nandito yung x squared plus y squared equals 25. The same na siya. So, minus ang gagamitin kong operation. 1 minus 18 over 32. So, simplified form niya ay 7y squared over 16. 25 minus 18, 7. So, cancel tong 7. So, 1 na lang natira dito. y squared is cross multiply 16 na dito. Cancel yung 7 dito sa kabilaan. So, y is plus minus 4 square root. Ito, square root. Dito, since circle and ellipse, so malamang 4 points yung intersection points nila. When y is equal to, sabihin natin negative 4 muna tayo. Substitute natin siya dito sa first equation kasi madali lang. x squared plus negative 4 squared equals 25. x squared, to ay 16. Lipat sa kabila, positive 9. 25 minus 16. Square root mo siya. So, x is plus minus 3. Ibig sabihin na, intersection point na yan ay 3, negative 4, and negative 3, and negative 4. Plus minus 3. So, ito yan, yung dalawa. So, when y is equal to positive 4 naman, Ganun pa rin, x squared plus 4 squared is equal to 25. So, x squared is equal to positive 9. x is plus minus 3. So, ibig sabihin, ang intersection point niya ay 3, positive 4, and negative 3, positive 4. So, apat na intersection points. Ito yun. Tapos, ito yung isa. Kung i-drawing natin siya, estimate lang, ito yung, ito yung circle na radius 5. So, radius natin dyan ay 5. Ang ellipse natin ay vertical ellipse kasi mas mahaba yung nasa ilalim ng Y. Ibig sabihin pa ganun yung ellipse natin. Yan, mahaba yung vertical or parallel to Y axis. Ito yung mga intersection points nila. So, ito is 3, 4. Ito, negative 3, 4. Ito, 
negative 3, negative 4. Ito, 3 and negative 4. Ayan siya.